In this video, we're going to see how to install Python on Windows 11. So to check to see if it's installed, you can start a Windows command prompt. And if I type Python version, notice it'll say Python was not found. Since this is available in the Microsoft Store, you can just type Python. That'll bring up the Microsoft Store if you want to go that route. But we're going to install it from the official Python website. So we're going to open up a browser and go to python.org org. We'll click downloads and then this should give you the latest release. We'll download it. That shouldn't take long. So once it's done, either navigate to your downloads folder or inside your browser, you should be able to click on it. So one of the things you want to make sure you do is that you add python.exe to your path so that you can run it from a command line. And let's customize the installation. We'll go ahead and keep all of this. Idle is an IDE that you may be interested in using. We'll go ahead and install it for all users, pre-compile the standard library. We don't necessarily need to download these. That's a good path. And then we're going to click install. We're going to let it make changes to our computer. And then we'll wait for the installation to complete. So this is telling us that setup was successful. You may see something here asking if it wants you to disable the path length limit. And if you get that option, I recommend that you accept it so that you save trouble later on. However, I've already expanded that, so I'm not seeing it here. It says setup was successful, so I'll close. And let's see if this is working. I'll start a command prompt. And if I say python.version, you can see that it says python 3.12.4. And if I open an editor, and I'll just do a quick hello world Python program, and then I will save it to this folder. And I'll make that a little bigger so that you can see what it says, although not super interesting. So now if I go to D, my D drive, I saved it to the develop folder, and I can say, say Python hello.py, and it says hello world, so we have Python installed. So that's a quick example of how to install Python on Windows 11. 